Welcome back to another video. Today we've got a special one for you guys. I've got the wave run on the back. The spot where we're heading today, it's about a two and a half hour drive from home and we're heading out the west coast. So you know what that means? That means game fish. So I am super excited. If you like jet ski adventures, fishing, catching cooks, all that kind of stuff, consider subscribing to this channel because we've got heaps of action coming your way. But anyway, I'll catch you guys in the water. See you then. And we're out here. Man, I'm excited about this. Alright, first time crossing this bar. Just a gun. Are you guys ready? I am. <laughs> Check out all those waves, man. Two lines out already. Um, I'm gonna put my bungee cord out. And hopefully, we get some fish. Hey, hey, West Coaster. Now we just wait. We're gonna cruise along here. Um, yeah, got three lures out the back, so hopefully, we get something good. I'd be so stoked if we get an elbow call. But anyway, I'm gonna have a drink of water. And I'll probably see you guys when I get a fish or when I get bored again. <laughs> anyway, catch you guys in the my fish! You guys a bit of an update we've been trolling for probably a good 40 odd minutes um yeah it's been pretty quiet at the moment but man it's uh oh, it's a beautiful day out yeah fish on guys steering right here it might be a albacore And fighting a fish and going straight is a lot more difficult than it looks. <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure it looks like I'm struggling in the video. <laughs> Show you, Callum, mate. I'll tell you guys now. Look at that. Doing the damage. Get him in the bin. Alright, let's just get back on course again. And then I'll put it back out. Speed up a little bit. Alright. Right, let's put the one out again. <laughs> oh. Other two rods are still, still good nick. Um, yeah. I'll see you guys 
see you guys when I've got another hookup. <laughs> oh man, it's uh, like you, you kind of get over it like crawling around because we've been doing it for like a good hour now and you kind of get over it and then you, then you get a hookup and it just changes everything. <laughs> Makes it worth it. Um, but yeah, we'll see if we can get a couple more and yeah, we don't really know what the plan is. Heading towards an, um, one of the islands and we're probably going to try and get a kingfish over there and yeah, we'll see what else we can get. Right, so we've just got to uh, one of the islands. Um, I'm probably going to bring in all my irons now and then yeah, just go have a look around, see if we can find any good, um, good signs for kingies or anything good really. We need to get a nice, nice kingfish. Um, the kingfish on the bottom might even drop for a snapper, see if we can find something. Yeah, I'm not too sure what's that, to be honest. Um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> but I love it, like honestly. Yesterday, if you asked, if you asked me yesterday at 5 o'clock what I was going to do today, I couldn't have told you. Um, literally last night, half past 9, we made the call, West Coast it is. And I caught my first tuna. Ah. Beautiful man, beautiful. Let me bring in these lines quick. There we are, one of the, at one of the islands now. Just look at all the birds on it, like holy crap. That is so many gannets, like is it, oh man. Literally the top of the island looks like snow, it's like completely white. Honestly, it's literally, but it's like it's just birds. And maybe a little bit of bird shit. <laughs> Alright, I've done the old switcheroo on lures. So I've got my jig on. You can see it in the background. Now it's basically just looking for the fish. See if we can find some good sign. And we'll try and get a kingy on board. Man, how cool is that look? That is awesome. I'm just happy to catch one. <laughs> My first ever West Coast Kingy. Little Kingy. I wanted to do a nice release, but okay. <laughs> For some reason, my fish finder's not working. It's not picking up the water depth. Oh, there we go. There we go. I think it just started working again. And it did. It's working again. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to check for a kingy. I literally just had a bronze. He swim right up to me. I didn't even have a fish. I didn't have anything in the water. He just swam up to me and looked at me and then buggered off again. Cheeky bugger. <laughs> anyway, let's do another drop. Looks like there's some fish down there. Alright, so the sharks have arrived, so we're gonna move. Um, yeah, we're just gonna try and find, find some fish in another spot. The sharks know, as soon as there's a bit of commotion in the water, a fish struggling, fighting, um, they're there. So, you might be able to land one fish, but once the sharks get there, you're gonna struggle. You're only gonna land half a fish. <laughs> Let's go see if we can find something. 
There's some good fish coming through right now. I should hook up on this drop. Literally should hook up. So look at the sounder. It's telling me that I will hook up. So. <laughs> hooked up and I lost everything. I hooked up to something with teeth. If only you guys could smell what I'm smelling. Man, those birds stink. Woo. We're back crawling again now. I didn't get one single kingfish. Well, I did get a kingfish, but um, too small for my liking. He was size. I could have could have brought him home, but I always like to get a, get them a little bit bigger. Um, but yeah, I've got two albacore in the in the bin already, so we're gonna see if we can get a couple more. Um, it's quite good. Get a couple of fresh albacore, give it to family and friends. Um, First time ever, so man, I'm, I'm stoked about that. Man. Ah. This is the light. If you ever want to relax, this is one way of relaxing. <laughs> it was it looked like a swordfish it was like jumping out of the water smashing jumping out of the water smashing <laughs> just to repeat the whole time that was honestly the best sight like ever I've never seen that in my life holy crap man oh that was cool Woo! that was exciting it was sitting in 40 meters of water like what the? Man! Going back in over the bar. So I'll bring you guys with us. sunburned I can feel it <laughs> man what a day what a long day literally I left home at four o'clock this morning it is now quarter to eight at night <laughs> that's what you call a day but it was worth it it was worth it I caught my first albacore tuna so 
I'm super stoked about that. Um, actually got three of them, so I am, man, I'm super stoked. And the funny thing is, <laughs> I'm such an amateur that literally the first one I caught, I thought it was a skippy. <laughs> I literally was even holding it up to the camera saying, oh, yeah, it's a good fish. It's a skippy though, but um, yeah, keep it for bait. <laughs> Little do I know, it's actually an albacore and it's really good eating. So those are going to be in the menu tonight. I am probably going to make some sashimi. Um, the fish are all cooling down, all chilled on ice at the moment. Just got home, sun setting there in the background. And here's my catch. Alright guys, all the fish is filleted, everything is done, and I am buying it now. Thank you for watching, really appreciate all the support. If you're new to this channel, and you like this kind of content, subscribe, and we'll have heaps more of this kind of content coming out, and so a lot more to come. But anyway, yeah, subscribe if you haven't, hit like, leave a comment, let us know what you think of the video. If there's anything you guys want to, are keen to see, let us know in the comments as well. And yeah, like I said, we're always keen to travel, so... If you're in the far north or somewhere in the, in, the, in the North Island, further south, I'm always keen to go go for a fish. Let us know and we can catch up with you. But anyway, we'll catch you guys on the next one.